you are web uh both of your characters so shocked me in so many ways sophia i want to start with your character how would you describe her to our viewers um she is so com so much more complex than what it appears on the surface um you know and, and and I think that it's easy to assume sometimes when someone is that much of a girly girl that it is, you know, stemmed from um, some sort of insecurity. And with Fatten, you know, she's she's not fat. Like, she's not insecure. And she's not ashamed of being the way that she is. Um, and I think that, you know, like finding your power in, in sort of embracing the things that you believe make you beautiful and make you who you are is um, something that you can be inspired by. Absolutely. Now, I watched this like two nights in a row back to back, like I just couldn't get enough of it. <laughs> Shannon, your character, I thought I had her pegged. Yeah. I had all my theories and I was like, okay, and she and this and this and this. And uh -huh. I was all the way wrong, like all the way wrong. <laughs> so tell our viewers a little bit about your character. Uh, Dot is a very just like headstrong, sturdy, she's kind of no nonsense uh, in a way. Um, and she's, she's the caretaker of the group, definitely. Um, but she'll also, she'll make you laugh, she'll make you cry and... <laughs> She was almost like the natural leader. And I think that that's why I jumped to conclusions so quickly. Um, very level-headed in the face of a storm. Would you say that's accurate? Oh, absolutely. She just was weirdly prepared for this. Yeah. Level-headed <laughs> to a fault. Man, I was like, wait, what a, wait a minute. Oh, <laughs> lady. So here's my question, because this is the only real question I, I have about the series. How we, we know that each of the characters' backstory and how they got chosen, I would say probably by parents or whatever their, their circumstances are. But like, did y'all really think you were going to Hawaii on a getaway when both of y'all were acting a fool? Absolutely. <laughs> I was on my way, you know? <laughs> I had my takis packed. I was I was ready. <laughs> I was so ready. <laughs> I, I had mean, those I camo know, like, cargo pants. <laughs> judging on ready. judging all the things that fat and packed as well, just like the, all of the such extravagant like I, items of clothing. It's like it's hard to imagine. Thirty seven condoms. <laughs> yeah, was ready. all the condoms like but <laughs> bedazzled like bikinis that don't even go into the water. Like she was like, so cannot, ready. You really cannot wear that some of those those swimsuits that I wore into the water. Right. Because it would like damage the, the, and the swimsuit. Watches, I was like, oh, she had her own game plan. Her own game plan. So listen, so uh, it's been said that it's the female version of Lord of the Flies. Would you say that was accurate? It's it doesn't follow the story. Yeah, it doesn't follow the story to the to a T. I think it's more of just like a female interpretation of Lord of the Flies. Fantastic. I love like the it. same scenario, but with all women. We're gonna it just answers the question. What would it be like if all women were on an island together? And I feel like this kind of weirdly <laughs> solves it. Yeah. We, we finally know. Like, there you go. All there English you go. teachers are gonna be rolling around look. being like, oh, I can't ask the <laughs> question anymore. They know. God. <laughs> Like and, students and just watch the season and copy it down verbatim. Yeah, yeah turn that in. <laughs> <laughs> There's my essay. <laughs> there was a girl named Fatten. <laughs> she wrote 37 oh, condoms. 300 <laughs> and something pages. Just <laughs> there you go. This looks familiar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, mm. Ladies, we're definitely going to need a second season. I'm already, I'm waiting on it. Uh, it's going to be fantastic. It's going to be a big hit. I appreciate you guys oh. taking the time to talk to me today. And oh, thank uh, you so thank much. You. Appreciate thank it. you. Bye. So nice to meet you. Have a good one. You too. Bye, guys.